All right, man. Uh, how's the wrist feeling? It's feeling good. Uh, I've had this cast, uh, this little soft cast on pretty much the whole week, but come game time, I should just be able to tape it and it feels fine. Uh, are, do you, are you expected to return punts? Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. Is it going to get in the way of interceptions this week? Nah, not at all. You know, I, you know, once a game really starts coming close, you know, that adrenaline kicks in. I always think adrenaline is, you know, the main cure for pain. And so, uh, you know, I feel like I won't feel it during the game. It'll be, I'll be fine. Uh, going against Keith Price, he's had a tendency to turn the ball over a little bit these past couple of games. Mm -hmm. What have you seen from him that has changed? Or because last year he was so explosive. He still is. He's very athletic. Uh, you know, he's he's one of their leaders on their team. You know, we're expecting to see the best Washington team that we've seen, you know, that they've played all season. And so, um, you know, he's very explosive. Um, you know, when he's on, he's on. Um, he finds ways to get it done. And, uh, you know, we're just going to have to contain him. You know, he's another quarterback who likes to run. Um, and like you said, he will make mistakes. And when those mistakes are made, we got to capitalize. Uh, talking about going to CenturyLink Field, playing at an NFL stadium, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it is. You know, it was, it was an experience playing there last year. And, you know, we got the win there last year. We're hoping to do the same this year. Can you talk about the matchup against, like, Case and Williams mm -hmm. and some of their other receivers? Uh, physical, you know, very physical. Um, you know, not necessarily, you know, speed guys, but very physical off the line. Um, who likes to get into you. Um, you know, good route runners and, uh, you know, have, have sure hands. What's the best way to rattle price? Pressure up front or really good coverage back? Uh, both. Um, you know, and also starting off good early. You know, I feel like if you if you, if you start hitting them in the mouth uh, early, you know, it's gonna it's gonna break them down. You know, throughout the game. And so we got it's, it's really important that we start off start out fast and and hit them hit them early. Are you getting nostalgic at all as you play these guys in your last season? That's, well, I, what does that mean? Like, are, you, are you thinking, ah, oh, this is the last time I'm going to be doing this? Oh, no, nah, not at all. You know, it's, um, you know, I'm just trying to enjoy every every moment I have out here with these guys. You know, I'm not worried about all that. You know, you know when the time's here, it's going to be here. So that's all I'm, you know, I'm not worried about that. Uh, for a guy like Scott going back home, for the team that maybe kind of overlooked him a little bit, mm -hmm. what, what do you think that's like for him? I'm sure he's fired up. You know, I'm sure he's fired up to go. Um, you know, I would be. <laughs> you know, uh, he's going back home. You know, he's gonna have he's gonna have another one. He's gonna have a Scott crying game. You know, he's that's, that's Scott crying. You know, he's a man, and I can only imagine how fired up he's gonna be going down to you know Seattle in front of his home people. No sophomore slump for him. I mean, boy, no, he's not at all. He's, he's he's been putting on a lot of work in the off season, and you know, um, it, it it's not a surprise to me at all. You know, I've seen him from last year to this year. Um, he's he's just a beast. As a cornerback, what's it like when the you got a guy who's like front doing that? Kind of it makes it a lot easier. And, you know, it makes quarterbacks um, turn the ball over because pressure's coming in their face. You know, they make poor decisions, um, and also. You know, we don't have to cover as long. You know, guys like Scott Crying, Dylan Wynn, seeing Milo Castro, Castro, you know, bullying the offensive line, it's, it makes it easy on us. Cool, man. Thanks. Yeah, no problem.